بسم الله الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله الطلبة الأعزاء السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وأهلا ومرحبا بكم في هذا الجزء الرابع عشر من المحور الثاني لمادة نظرية الآلات Theory of Machines We continue with inversions Here we'll take the example of slider crank Here we have the slider crank Link number one is called ground Link number two is the crank Link number three is the connecting road And number four is the slider Okay, so different mechanism by fixing different link of slider crank chain are as follows. These are inversion. First inversion, this inversion is obtained when link number one is grounded, as shown in this figure. That means it's fixed. So application for this inversion, reciprocating engine, reciprocating compressor, etc. Second inversion. This inversion is obtained when link number two, the crank, this is the crank, link number two, is grounded, is fixed as a, an application. So, Whitworth quick return mechanism, rotary engine, etc. Third inversion, this inversion is obtained when link number three, the connecting road, is fixed or grounded as an application for this. Slaughter crank mechanism, oscillatory engine, etc. Fourth inversion. This inversion is obtained when link number four, the slider, is grounded or fixed as an application, hand pump, pendulum pump, etc. This is animation for the first inversion. Here, this is the standard slider crank mechanism. Okay. So the input motion it can be given to the slider or to the crankshaft but the cylinder or the uh, uh, link number one is fixed or grounded here the fourth inversion in this animation you can see the slider is grounded or fixed here let's see here some other some other examples here also, here we can see uh, uh, slider crank inversions, all types, okay? You can see for the first one here, slider block translates, okay? For this one, slider block has complex motion. Let's see. Let's follow the slider crank motion. Third one here. So slider block rotate, you'll see, makes rotation here. And fourth one here, let's see, slider block is a stationary, okay? Let's see here four bar mechanism inversions, okay? So both here, two non-distinct, so crank rotor rocker inversions, crank rocker inversions, you can see, it is called a crash of four bar linkage, we will see in the next lecture, what is crash, crash of four bar linkage? Okay, this one it is called a double crank inversion, and here double rocker inversion. Let's see again. Okay, you can see the difference between double crank inversion and double rocker inversion. Okay, 